this is Zachary Walls reporting for Friendship News Network, and recently we visited the Supreme Court in Times Square, New York, where we asked people about gun violence and what they would do to decrease it. Now let's see what they had to say in their interviews. I think that when, uh, if we want to prioritize gun safety, we need to make sure that everyone who's using a gun is safe with it, and with background checks we can ensure uh, that the people who are getting access to a gun are the people who are going to be safe with it? Uh, checking the, the person's criminal record, if there's any, uh, a longer waiting period, like I said, 30 days. And it has to be some kind of reference, you know, reference from work, reference from parents, reference from neighbors, you know, so that way by the time the 30 days come by, you know, there's a police background already done. There's a wa waiting period, reference. So by the time you get the gun, everything's clear. I think uh, stricter background checks is a must. Like, especially if you look at the most recent shootings, like some of these people should not be getting guns in their hands, especially with the stuff they post on social media and like just everything with their like online persona. So a lot of a lot of these people are connected to like saying like you know stuff on the internet like they're going to shoot up their school or like being connected to white supremacist groups like domestic terrorists stuff like that where it's like pretty evident that if somebody did a background check on these people they should not be getting their hands on the guns hopefully what people said today can lead to changes for the better in gun control laws across the nation this is Zachary Walls for Friendship News Network signing off <laughs>